There's a lot of replay value here. Choose from five different type of cars you'll want to use and test your skills with a friend over and over again. Overall, the sound and the graphics and the gameplay is excellent for this time period. Should you come across this cartridge at a garage sale, I highly recommend that you pick one up. between a jump shot, which is less likely to be blocked, but only hits at close range, or a set shot, which can hit from long distances, but has a greater chance of being blocked. On defense, the player controls one member of the team, considered the captain. The defense can block shots, intercept passes, Go for it!
creating my character, you can see the three basic stats every character has. Hardiness, Agility, and Charisma. Hardiness is basically the hit points. So if you have Hardiness, hardiness 9, you have 9 hit points. And you have 10 times your Hardiness in uh, carrying capacity. During the actual race, the directional disc is used to move a horse along, while the side buttons perform two functions. The top button is to coax a horse along, while the bottom button is used for whipping the horse. Each race takes place on any of the three different types of track, dirt, turf or muddy.
gonna kill me, excellent. That is the random level generation and also important is the lack of saving. You can save, right? So you can quit your session and come back later if you're having a good game. But you can't save and reload when things go wrong, right? That is against the principles of the roguelike.